Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of my Darkness Falls series. So I was working on one of the doors last night. This is going to take a lot longer than I thought it was going to take. Um, I got a lot of the building updated. I'll show you here in a second. That one knocked out. So I got a bunch of this upgraded to um, either concrete or reinforced concrete here because I'm not sure if the zombies are going to attack this building at all tonight. We have to take these stairs out, I think. Otherwise, they're going to try and hit up that door. And I think they were just in the way down here. So these guys have to come out um, probably today. I'm thinking that we forego the treasure maps today and get this base into shape before tomorrow. Because I think if we try and get it done at the last minute, I'm going to run out of time. Because I really have no idea how long this is going to take. So what we want to do is we want to knock these out. This will take a little bit. And we'll knock these stairs out today. Get both of the... Um, I got the framework of this one kind of up on the inside here. This is where the door is going to go. So the door requires four blocks this way. And if I bring it in more than this here, we're really encroaching on our internal space. And I don't want to do that. So we're going to run it out a couple. Um, and the same over here, it has to go out a couple because we can't come back into here and have it the door end here because then it might even block the zombies from going up the stairs. So, yeah, we got to have this area here, one like this free so that they can get up the stairs. So all this has got to come out today. We're going to do this one first. We might get to the second one before the horde. I'm hoping we do. But we're kind of bottleneck bottle with concrete again. It always seems to be the issue is we always run short on concrete. So let me knock this out. Uh, I'll get this set up ready to go. We'll knock it all out and then I'll come back. Okay, so that's the base of where this is going to be. Now, let's get these in. We'll go ahead and throw the door in. Now the door is just forged iron. I'm not too worried about, like, if during the day the zombies want to, like, beat on it or whatever. They're not going to do that much damage to it, so I'm not that worried about it. But what I am worried about, though, is them getting to that door. So I think we need to break out this stuff and put angle blocks in here to kind of force them to where we want them to be. So we get the angle blocks in there. We gotta do this side still too. So this is the wall. How are we looking for concrete here? Not a lot left. So that needs to go all the way up. I wonder if we, um, like if we take all of this out and make it solid, like this part right here, and the same on this side. We take all this out, make it solid. That way they'd be like, okay, that's too many hit points to break through, so we'll just go in here. Yeah, I think that's probably what we do. Okay, and then we want to go across the top here. Like that, and it's going to need to come down one, I think, too, because the door... Right here... Goes in there. With the lousy texture. Nope, that's perfect. That's the perfect height. Excellent. And we're out. Alright, let's go back inside and get some more concrete. So I made a huge mistake yesterday. I put the, the wood in these forges and forgot to turn them on. I have no idea why I didn't think I needed to turn them on. But I just didn't turn them on. So we, we wasted a whole day of uh, cement production. So eh, not much I could do about that. Get that going. How much we got in here now. Alright, we're doing okay for, for concrete here. I wish these textures weren't so flashy, but whatever. Alright, let's get back over here. Yeah, I'm not going to worry about these guys right here. Right? Because they're not going to... Like... That's not going to get hit at all tonight, I don't think. Right? Just going to worry about this door. All right, let's work on this section here now. And I think we leave it like that. You know what, maybe we put angle blocks in here. Uh, shape, angle, 
and then we go yeah I was thinking that maybe we do no let's do it this way um, it's gonna look better this way let's go like this and then we do advanced Did I miss it? How did I miss it? No. There it is. So like this. And then we do... Shape the wedge tips. Just a little smoother, you know? That looks a little better than uh, what we had, I think. Yeah, and then we'll do the same on this side. We'll take all this out. So let's do that now. I'm waiting for a screamer to be called in. Like, I, I'm totally expecting a screamer to show up. Alright, uh, let's get this this way. And then we want to go with shape. Where are you here? Oh, wait. No, we don't. We want to do... Right. Gotta take these out again. We want to do that out one. So these guys are going to be here. And then let's do shape. Uh, where are you here? These guys. We'll just put two in for now. That way I can copy the shape afterwards. Um, and the rotation. Uh, or at least just the shape. Anyway, put you in. Let's get you guys up here. And then you guys in. Now we're not going to get that upgraded to concrete unless they, the zombies break through that wall. If they break through the wall, then yeah, we upgrade it to concrete. But right now, we don't need to. Alright, there we go. Now I probably should put... Plates or... Uh, let's go back to this for a second. Let's at least do this. Y you seriously going to do that, are you? Thanks for that. Thanks for uh, thanks for showing up, buddy. Appreciate it. Like all your help there. Yeah, we're just gonna do that. Just to at least raise the ground up so it's how much damage did you take? Oh, you took like 30 something. That's not bad. Might as well take the free meat while it's here. Unless I gotta get later. Alright. So that's that. I think that's going to work for tonight. Or for tomorrow night, that is. You know, and then up above on top. Like, it's only four blocks high, so the zombies technically could stack up and get up on top if they wanted to. Over here. But I think with the spikes pointing outwards... Like, I got spikes here. Uh, let's take you out for a second. So if we put them, like, go on face, like that... You know? I think that's going to make a big difference. Let's just put these in here for now. And then, as much as I hate to do this, I don't think it matters with these guys. I think they can stay there. I'm not going to upgrade them. I'll just leave it. Can I upgrade these to... Oh, I can. I don't have a lot of iron. Let's just do that there. Um, yeah, so if they knock the bottom ones out, that's fine. We have damage on here. We do. Yeah. See, they were they were stacked up there. I wonder if they'll stand on these. That's a good question. I wonder if they'll stand on top of these. That's an interesting question. Well, I guess we'll find out. So you guys are okay. Let's do. Um, a little bit of aesthetics here. Let's take this. Put you all along here. I'm only going to do this corner right now because I think this is the corner that they're going to do the most amount of damage to, probably. Because our other door is going to be here eventually. I might just knock a hole for them to get through tonight rather than doing the whole door. Or tomorrow night, I mean. Um... 
Yeah, I think that's what we're going to do. But we do it this way here, just so that it's a little smoother get for them to get around the corner. They won't be get caught in the center, like in that little bit there. So let's take this out of here. We'll leave those metal plates up there. Can we repair these? These are okay. All right. Losing my voice again. All right, that's good. And on face still. Beautiful. Yeah, I think like that. It looks kind of goofy. I don't foresee them wanting to bang on the walls, though. Like, I, I can't foresee them with the, with that door open and another opening here. And if we have the front door open, the only thing that's left is this far wall. So yeah, the only thing we'll be left with is, will be this wall here. And I mean, we could leave them a little opening here to get in. I mean, we could do that. They're, like, if I make an opening, then they're, I think they might be more inclined to go into the opening I give them, rather than just breaking through randomly. Like, I don't want them to break through here, where the trader is, and then be banging on the trader. Yeah, I gotta think about that. I'm not gonna worry about it for this horde, I don't think. We'll see what they do, this horde. But let's get this side updated anyway. So you... So yeah, you're the end of the door. So all this is going to be... Not going to be spikes. Hmm. Maybe I got to... Let's... Uh... Let's knock it out. Because we want to do the angle block, right? Let's just knock this out first. Because we do want to have the angle blocks in there. So that is there. And it's going to go out one more. So let's make this an opening for now. Okay, so it will be coming out there and then... Yeah, so this has got to be a solid wall, I guess. So let's make this into a solid wall. You know, we might have time to do this. Ooh. Nobody? I'm, I'm kind of shocked that there's no trader or no uh, screamer yet. I thought for sure a screamer would have would have spawned in by now. Okay. And then I guess we should probably do... Let's dig the ground out, where I know we need to do it. Right to there. And we need to go one more. Because the wall is going to be right here. So this becomes... Where's my rebar? Don't got a lot left. Yeah, I'm glad I did this today. Because doing it tomorrow would have been bad, I think. So let's get this uh, knocked in. So that's that side. And then this is do it like that, I guess. Really? What is it about cows and wanting to know what the hell I'm doing? At least he's slow. Okay, so all this has got to come out now. Okay, before we do the next bit, let's go inside, get some more concrete moving, get some more concrete onto us. Hopefully being in here for a little bit will drop the heat mask a little bit. I think there's uh, I know there's a screamer coming soon. Only 23. Oh, because it didn't... Uh, Let's get uh, 1,500. Let's get it started. What do I have in here? All the darts. That's still moving. Okay, let's we'll put this into here for now. That started. Get this out of there. Alright, we're just going to attempt to drop this bit here. 
That'll save us a bit of time. Yeah, we're out of stamina. So we're gonna draw. Actually, you know what? Let's go get some. Uh, while we're waiting for our stamina to come back, let's go in here and grab. Uh, let's grab two. Of you. Oh, let's grab. Yeah, I just use two of you. Good enough. Excellent. Oh, we got a harvest today too. I forgot about that. All right, so we're gonna attempt to drop these uh, blocks here in the center. Save me a little bit of time. And there we go. And hopefully we can drop this spike here too. Yep. Okay, that's that done. Now, let's get the floor knocked in here. I think we could probably get away with not having to do this whole thing. Just enough to get the door into place. Let's get these updated. Like that. Then we need to have one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And we, we got enough to just go across here with one of these. About to make some more rebar tonight. I don't think we got enough concrete for this though. Find out in a second. Yep, we got a little bit short. That's fine though, we can get the door in now. Where's our door? There it is. Beautiful, so that door is in. Okay, so let's go ahead and put in our wedges here. So we wanna go back to, where are you here? This guy. And I think we gotta go back. Okay, that's that side knocked in. And then we just gotta go ahead and break out all of the uh, metal here. This is obviously not the best utilization of our guard positioning, but... Oh. Shit. Where are they going? They broke all my blocks down there. Ow! Fuck, don't shoot me! Yeah, screamer hordes are no joke. We got a guy in the base. Gonna be out of ammo here in a second. Uh, what do we do? Fuck. Ah, oh, shit, he got up here. Okay, uh... We got problems. Capital P. Let's get, uh, I don't know what to do. AK, get the AK out. Uh, oh, this is fun. Eh? Come on, reload. I'm already reloading, I'm already reloading. Well. Oh, we know the base works. Oh shit, they're going up here. Uh, reload. Okay, we cannot have it end this way. So I gotta get the hell out of this base. What is going on with this? Oh my god! Just drive! <laughs> oh Christ! What the hell was up with that? It's almost like there's an error in the coding for some mob. 
Like, there's got to be an error in the coding for one of the mobs. Okay, we need to retake the base now. Thing is, I gotta be careful how much noise I'm gonna make. Cause we just call it another screamer. Ooh, that's nice. We got a grenade. Okay. Hey, mama. What's up? Okay. Your mini bike with us. Park it right here and we'll turn it around. Looks like we killed the dog. The screamer's still there. Man, they just made a like, oh, there you are. Should have missed her. Did they get her? Sounded like they killed her. Wow, they made short work of this place. It's because I didn't have the uh, that one corner up with concrete. If I had the concrete in that corner, it would have bought me enough time. But you can see what I mean about like having to have the doors. Did they break that door? Yeah, they broke that door. And this one. And they're gone. Wow. Wow. Okay, well... Let's uh, finish upgrading this part. <laughs> part that we have left. Hope we didn't lose any guards. I'll have to check that here in a second. So I left. Part of it was my... Actually, you know what? Let's put that... Let's... Where's that other door? we got to go make another door now. I'm going to put it back over on this one. Yeah, they broke this door out. That didn't last very long. Did not last very long. So we have to have it open on Horde Night or they're just going to rip it, rip, rip through it like it's nothing. So what I did, and it was my error, is that I left two blocks here. And they saw that as a way to get around and up the stairs to me. Did we lose? We lost the guard that was here. She died. And that's it. These guys are at full. Probably because she was shooting at them. This guy's at full. Oh, we lost the guy up here too. Oh, we lost two guards. This guy was gone from before. How are you guys doing? Okay. Okay. Yeah, see, we got to make it so that... There's no way the the zombies can get to the guards on these on these walkways. Like my my thought was to knock out the walkway, right? They'll, these guys will drop, knock out the walkway, and then put bars in, and a covering on top of the bars, like over top of them as well, all the way along. So it's a fighting platform, and then and if we need to get to it, we can get up on top of there and then drop down and I'll have a hatch that we can fall in and we can be on this fighting platform if we need to. But these can't stay here. Those can't stay there. Not concrete. 
Wow. Okay, let's go get some stuff going then. Uh, it's a good thing I pulled these up too. Although you notice they just made a straight beeline through there, right around and then right up into here and then came down the stairs here and and just came right out the right out this window. So their pathfinding is impeccable. We have to be very very careful. That's the front door. Uh, let's do it in here. Rolling garage door. Springs and mechanical parts. Man, I'm still like... <laughs> I'm still freaking out. That's crazy. I thought we were going to die for sure. I thought that was over. I'm like, what am I going to do? I, I can't fight them off in here. I mean, I guess I could have run into the horde base and closed everything up. I guess. But I had, I had panicked so badly that it was like, at that point, it was like, there's nothing I could do. Like, I, I there's... There was no, uh, there was no thought at that point. It was just, how do I save myself? All right, well, we got a few things. Magnum coil rounds. That can go in there for now. Uh, hang on to those. Uh, you can go into the building materials. Maybe we'll get that wired up today. I don't know yet. Uh, we got to get these wired up. Oh, uh, gun parts. So we got the uh, coil gun grip. Okay, it's nice. Uh, oh, bottom ammo. Yeah, we can drop this off in here. Gonna make sure I carry my full stack of uh, ammo with me here. And the AK can go back for now. Oh my god. Can't say this game's not fun, though. Like, that was, like, super fun. I was shocked that we're alive, though. That's, I honestly... I thought for sure that was it. I just saw it. I think, oh, well, there it goes. I guess I'll have to continue the series with a death. I want to try and play so that we don't die, obviously. But if we end up dying, then I'll have to, like, figure out what we do at that point. All right, we need to make more rebar, too. So let's get this part in. Uh, that one, I think. Okay. And then let's get this this part smoothed out. Uh, and then I think we'll we'll calm things down a bit by <laughs> going to make a car or something. <sighs> we lost two guards, man. Well, it is the risk of actually uh, living in the trader, right? It's just inevitable that some guards are going to die. And this Traders is one of the worst, I mean, other than Hughes. I think probably Trader Hughes is probably the worst place to try and fortify, if I had to guess. But this one here is so big, right? If it had a much smaller footprint, it wouldn't be so bad because we wouldn't be, like, we wouldn't need so many resources to, to update it to a point where it's like defensible, you know? Okay, let's get these updated. All right, so um, that door open right now? It is. Let's close it up because I don't think we're not going to do much to call in a screamer horde at this point. Is front door closed? Nope, it's open. Let's drive the bike back in. God, the sun's almost down too. Ooh. All right, we definitely need to th rethink some of this. I wish I could have a like I know that I know you can set up motion sensors to um, trigger zombies to like uh, uh, the doors to open when they spot zombies or people, or you can choose which one it's going to be. We got way too much time to wait for that. All right, let's set up our mechanic station. It's cheap, so we're going to put it down here for now. I mean, technically it should be down here anyway, so let's put it right here. All right, now, uh, where is our, there it is. So we can make, that's kind of cool. That's just straight up forged steel mechanical parts and headlights. Wow, that's pretty simple to make. Blue K 
Camo. Do we go with camo or black? Car seat, steering assembly. So motorcycle chassis and I think we make the motorbike first. Do we? Or do we just go straight this way? So car chassis. Oh, that's just the chassis. Oh, I see. So it is a lot more. We gotta make car seats, steering assemblies, V8 engine. So that's a lot of that's gonna be a lot of steel. So let's just make a motorbike. I think we might have enough for that. So the chassis is like super cheap. Yeah, let's go grab some stuff from upstairs. Ah, I'm still freaking out. Oh man, there was so many. It, it, like the one screamer called in another screamer and then it was just, at that point, it's like, what do you do? All right, I don't know if I need oil or not. Uh, these guys should not be in here. You should not be in here. You should not be in here. You should not be in there. All right, let's put these guys away. We do have two wheels, though. That's a bonus. Uh, casings can go down here. You can go down here. You go up there. We're supposed to check the trader today, too. We need lights. Oh, we need a battery. We don't have a battery. Uh, I don't think we can make a battery, either. But you know what? We can get everything together. And then I can go battery fishing. Yeah. Uh, let's see here. Wheels. Actually, let's go listen outside and see if it's crickets yet. Yeah, it is. I was going to say, we could probably go find some cars. There's a broken one over there. Let's just go real quick. I should probably get an impact driver going, too. Don't know if we'll find one in here, but worth a shot anyway. No, nope. I don't think there's anything else around. Close by. There wasn't one in that garage. Yeah, I think we've hit up all the close ones. Alright, fair enough. I don't think we have a battery in any of our... Huh. What if we have a battery in... Uh... Probably close that. And close that. Well, it's nice to know that both those doors were open. And because the ladder was here, they didn't see this as a way to get to me. So they may not attack this building at night, which is a good thing. Uh, actually, we need to be down here anyway. Okay, so... Let's go with... What are we missing here? Okay, chassis, craft, handlebars, craft... So all we need now, we've got the wheels, we've got the engine. We can make a lead car battery. Lead, brass, and a bottle of acid. Ooh, okay. Damn, that's nice. Uh, do we have any lead, though? I think we do. Yeah, lead, acid, and brass, which we got a crap ton of. So let's go ahead and make a battery. Lead car battery, craft. So, Xenon Headlights is a mod. I, I know there's other mods in here, like Turbo and things like that, too, right? Armor Plating. That's kind of cool. Engine Turbo. Will that fit? What will that fit on, though? Increases maximum, minimum and maximum speeds by 200%. Well, that's cool. Spikes. Doubles the damage to zombies. Plating reduces past damage past to the player by 50%. Oh, okay, cool. Engine economy reduces fuel uses by 50%. Now, I think this one and the turbo is like you can either use one or the other. We don't have to worry about fuel uses. We're in a desert. We can get as much fuel as we need. So that's fine. 
car steering. So we're going to have to start working on getting all the materials to get this stuff done. Car seats. So we need a lot of duct tape, it looks like. Because we need... Where's the muscle car? Probably going to go with the black one, I think. So we need two seats, four steering assembly, V8 engine and a battery. So the battery we can make, V8, we require silver for. So that's what it is. Couldn't get you couldn't have us get a four banger, huh? Had to be had to be a V8. I guess so though. Kind of makes sense. Uh for the type of car it is anyway. The chassis. Okay, so we're gonna need how much duct tape are we gonna need now? So we need 20 for each of these, and we need two of the two of those, so that's 40. And then 20 for each of these. We, we need four of them, so that's 80. So we need 120 duct tape. Which we should be able to do, I think. Go away. Just, I'm not in the mood at the moment. Not in the mood for your friggin' shenanigans. Stop it. Okay, um... So, duct tape. Let's get some duct tape moving. Uh, where's our... We only got 57, huh? But we can do... How much... How many water bottles do we have? 62. They're banging on a wall out there now. Oh, they're over there. Wait a minute. I put the grenade away. Damn it. I was gonna say... Ah, I was hoping we could jump that. Oh, I guess I better, um... Lock this up, too. Oh, hey, you heard me, eh? Let's do this. Keep on knocking, but you can't come in. Oh, maybe you can. Hey! Over here! Is that it? Looks like it. Alright, let's fix this up. Should have fixed that up before, but... Completely forgotten that... That mo broke through there one day. That's a big boy. Well, should I go get him or what? I don't know. Forget it. I'm not going to do it. If he bangs, I'll go get him at that point. Alright, we're figuring out... Oh, I know what we were doing. Before we finish today off... Well, they even broke that down. Let's get... Oh, for Christ's sake. Don't bang on the door. We don't want any. Okay, let's get these harvested before the day ends completely. And then I'll get... So that's still growing. Growing. Man, this is taking forever. Okay, we filled up our water at the... Uh, thing here. Took them both, which I find kind of find shocking. I don't know why it would take both of them. All right. Well, at least we'll be able to make some steak and potatoes. This is grown, grown. All right. Not bad. So we got our water. I'm gonna go ahead and make the duct tape tonight. Uh. Drop that. We got a wide open wall right now. To drop that door in tonight. Uh, I wish there was a way I could armor the door up. I can't think of how I would armor the door though. Uh, we need this. Do I make. Let's just make steak and potatoes, I guess. Yeah, probably. How many can I get here? 
I gotta get wood too. I can only make four, huh? Well, we really gotta work on our food production. Let's get these going. A blueberry pie. I think we need water for. We need eggs too, cornmeal, and bottled water. Hear somebody banging out there again. So we got lots of blueberries. Um, we got lots of water. What else did I say we needed? Got the animal fat. Uh, brain is going. Oh, we need cornmeal. We've only got one. We've got lots of corn, though, so I can turn. Let's get. Actually, you know what? Let's go to the trader real quick before we end the episode. We're going to go to the trader. If there's somebody outside, we'll kill them. Nope, sound pretty quiet. You're cutting it close, aren't you? Yeah, well, I'm always cutting it close. You know me. Uh, inventory. Do you have cornmeal? Do not have any food at all? Oh, here we go. No cornmeal. All right, well, whatever. Anything good? We want to sell you this. Cigar. Now we've already got I a have cigar, to come right? Back and see me sometime. We do. Uh, okay, let's see. Bullet casings, I think we're good. We want all your gunpowder. I made more 9 mil ammo too, so maybe I should just take stuff, because our forges are tied up right now. Uh, okay. Um, sure I'm forgetting stuff here. Shotgun stock. Parts. Can't remember what we need here. We got coins, so I'm okay. Um, animal fat, we're good on. We can get that easily enough. Clay, it's 10 per 150. So you got. That's super cheap. This saves me having to go mine it, right? Like. Because it's so cheap, there's no point. It's just time savers. Uh, honey, we can get upstairs. Okay. And then, anything clothing-wise you want? I don't think so. I think we're good for now. I hope All right. get feeling better. Yeah, me too. I gotta make cornmeal then. So cornmeal... ...is just one corn, right? Yeah, so let's just make, uh... Make 11. Anything good in here? One can of chili. Four cans of pasta. Let's buy those. Buy the chili. Uh, gonna buy the dog food because we need that for learning elixir and we, uh, I'm gonna be making that later once we get Master Chef. So I want to at least have it on hand so that when we actually go ahead and do make it, uh, we actually have it on us. So let's put those in there, and we can go ahead now and make some blueberry pies. A minute and ten. So how many can we make? None, apparently, because eggs. Just need twelve eggs. We got seventeen. Should really be saving those for for uh, ink, but how are we doing here? Yeah, we don't have enough to make the next class book yet, but we'll worry about it later. Um, okay, so 110 per, so we're looking at 11.45, so 15. Sure, get those going. Alright, well at least we got food. We got plenty of drinks, I'm not worried about that. Okay, those guys can go back in there, you can go in there. And I think this is where, because we don't have a battery yet, so I'm going to end the episode here. Tomorrow we're going to go looking for a battery. Because um, we have these guys ready, and we just, all we need, oh, we got a battery. Ah, never mind, right. Durr, motorcycle, craft. We're riding a motorbike in the morning. That's awesome. I'm going to make another battery too, though. Let's get that going anyway. Let's make two. 
um, just because we'll use one for the car and then one uh, as a backup just in case we need it for something it's nice to have it in storage now we wanted to do bring you out we got 119 so that's going to take a long time in here we can do it in the chem station though right uh glue five and why is it oh bowls of sap i don't even know how to get sap 25 minutes so that's uh 12 24 32 did i get that wrong i got it wrong 38 No, I had it right. 32. Yeah. Yeah. I, I don't know what the hell. Alright, my brain's going for shit, so I'm going to end the episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe, and you can drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.